Okay, this is Dragon Opportunity, and welcome back to Pokemon Violet. In the last video, I took on the Elite Four members, which consisted of Rika, Poppy, Larry, and Hassel. So now, there's one more phase of the test. Are you ready to face the final test of the champion assessment? Yes. One final test. One more person to fight. Welcome, Mariashna. It gives me great joy that you managed to make it all the way to the pinnacle of the Pokemon League. The final chest... The final chest... The final test... Is a battle against me. The top champion. Let's just ignore I said that. To pass, all you need to do is win. But before we get started, I should apologise for one thing. You see, I have a trait that some might say is inappropriate for the League Chairwoman. I am utterly incapable of holding back when it comes to Pokemon battles. Maybe that's why nobody's passed this test recently. It's a bit of a problem, to be honest. But you, you might manage something... Yeah, you might manage something wonderful, like Champion Nimona did. So, are you ready for your final test? I want to see the true measure of your talent. You're challenged by top champion Gita. Espafra. I do hope you can defeat me and become a champion yourself. I hope so too. Level 61! Alright, that's Spafra down. Yes, that was the correct decision in the situation. Please continue. I plan to. Spafra fainted. Avalog. Let's keep you in. I thought I probably should have sent in Rodan. Oh well. This lets me get some experience, some health back. I keep making that bloody mistake when going for that move. Uh -huh. What's the matter? You're not one to let something so insignificant fluster you. No, nah, you're right, I'm not. Six Pokemon, eh? Have a look, fainted. King Gambit. You're... Steel Dark, I think? Well, he's Ponyard and... What is that one called? Bisharp. They were also Steel Dark. Supreme Overlord has gained strength from the Fallen. Imagine if you came out, like, last. That would be terrifying. Go goat, go goat, go goat. Um, hmm. Yeah, Freya will do. Now, are you grass normal, grass pure, or grass fighting? I think it's grass normal.
Well, either way. The loser. I have crunch, right? Aye. Old breaker. Alright, two Pokemon left. Crunch. Alright, he's gonna get a move off. Psycho cut. That was a crit. Oh, a critical hit. Poor thing. I'm glad you have dialogue for that. And ba-boom. Glimora, Glimora. That was rock poison, wasn't it? Rodan, it's you. So, what would your terror type be then? <laughs> Don't think you've won just yet. Send out Glimora. Be the light that like guides all trainers, Glamora. Okay, you're rock terror. Okay, okay. So you're no longer. Toxic debris, oh boy. Okay, that's toxic spikes as well. Sure, might as well terror myself. I forget what your terror type is. Is it fighting? Please say it's fighting. It is. Lovely. And body press. And with that, we're now champion. Glamour fainted. He defeated top champion Gita. go beyond my imagination so easily. Such overwhelming power. Such amazing skill. It seems Paldir has gained another wonderful trainer to be proud of. Congratulations. It's my honor to call you Champion Mary Ashner. Congratulations is right. Now I can really say you're good to go. Yay, you did it, miss. Congratulations. Just, just, just amazing. I can't, I can't hold it in anymore. Oof, crying again. You Pokemon trainers are the treasure of Paldia. And amid that treasure... Champions are the jewels that shine brightest. Champion Mariashna, it is now your duty to set an example for all of the trainers of Paldia. Now allow me to walk you back to the entrance. I'm certain you'll find a familiar face awaiting you. Al? Mariashna, Mariashna! Oh man, I can tell just looking at you. You did it right? You became a champion? Yes. Ha ha! I knew all along. I got word from La Primera when you cleared the elite test. Oh man. I'm a champion, and now you're a champion! Everyone's a champion! Which means we're true equals. You and me. Both champion ranked trainers. This is amazing! Now that you've made it here, I've got one thing to say. Let's you and me be best rivals for life. Aww. Yes! Tomaya! Alright, you know what rivals do. Battle their absolute hearts out. 
I'm going to hit you with everything this time. You ready? Do wait a minute, Champion Nomona. Huh? What's the matter, Primera? The Champion Assessment has only just ended. I believe the rest is in order for Champion Marashna, Serulich, and the others. Champions must be understanding towards their opponents. Ugh, right. There I go, getting overexcited again. Sorry, Marashna and Serulich. I also must ask, is this roadside really the setting you want? Or you two want for your first battle as true equals and rivals? Hmm, <laughs> now you mention it. That's a good spot. In that case, can we use one of the Pokemon League battle courts? Surely there's somewhere more fitting. A place with special meaning for the two of you, perhaps. Special meaning, huh? Mm, let's see, anywhere leap to mind? Hmm. I mean, behind, besides the house was the first place we fought. Haha, <laughs> beach out back, huh? Yeah, the place where we had a first battle might work. But on the other hand, to me, it's just kind of my backyard, you know, a little ordinary. Any place else come to mind? The treasure eatery? Is it significant to the two of you somehow? Uh, are you thinking of it because it's got the Medali Jim's Battle Court? I guess it does bring back memories of Larry. Larry may not appreciate the surprise visit. If you have any other suitable places in mind, would you prioritize them instead, please? Mesagoza. Mesagoza. Oh, good call. The place where we set out on our journey. That reminds me. Remember back when Director Clevel explained the treasure hunt? You know how he told us to go in search of our own treasure? Well, I know what treasure I've got out of all this. I found a true rival. Someone who can stand up to me at my full capabilities. That's right, I mean you. I'm so glad I got to meet you. Anyway, that being said, I'll be waiting for you at the Battle Court in Mesa Goza's Central Plaza. See you there. Okie dokie. The respect you two share is palpable. Even a bit enviable, to be honest. I am known as La Primera, but even when facing me in the final test of her champion assessment, Champion Nimona didn't reveal her true her full might. In you, I suspect she has found someone she can battle without holding anything back. Okay. Battle Nimona. So what happens if I talk to you again? Congratulations on passing the champion assessment. There are just gimmickles everywhere around here, aren't there? And they are annoying me. Ooh, you gave me ten. That's nice. Yeah, you lot need healing. And I believe now that I am the champion, they should have some marks I can give them. Or ribbons. Either way. Alright, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yep, there it is. Paldea Champion Ribbon. A ribbon rewarded for becoming a Paldea Champion and entering the Paldea Hall of Fame. So now I can give them all that then. That way. Yay! So, Battle Nemona then. Battle Nemona. Come on, let me. There we go. Uh, let me fly to Uva Academy, and I guess I'll go downwards. And Battle Nemona. Right, so she should be here then. Yeah. Yeah, there she is. I gotta wonder if the trainer card has changed in any form. Uh, let's see. Not by the looks of it. No. Hi, Nimona. 
Any second now. Ah, there you are, Mariashna. You ready for a battle between champions? Because all these folks here seem ready to watch. Word got around, I guess. Gee, I wonder how. And out of every single person gathered here, I'm the most excited by a mile. Hey, Clavel. The stage is set. It's my all-out power. This is your strength in full fruition. Let's see who comes out on top. You're challenged by Champion Namona. Lycan Rock. And I start out with Solaire. Finally, the thing I've waited f all this time for. Time to begin our greatest battle of all. Why do I feel like you'd be best friends with Leon? Um, I have the wrong Pokemon after this, and you are level 65. Lovely. Um, yeah. Switch the right arm. Yeah, good thing I did Stone Edge. Liquidation. Oh, Stealth Rock. And I don't have a spin move to get rid of that. Lovely. To think I helped teach you type matchups, and now you're using them to put the herd on me. Paul Mart. Fighting electric. Fighting electric. Sarah Ledge. Aye. All right. Those. I swear I'm about to replace this controller. Double shock. What's double shock? Alright. Hmm. Am I gonna be able to take another one of those? Bunch. Oh, that'd be good against. That'd be good against ground. Although with with fighting, it does cover the electric weakness. Hmm. I really want to make a bloody fighting mono team. That'd be fun. Yeah, let's keep you in for uh, for him. Beta Blade! Let's get my health back! Not experience, get my health back. Earthquake. Oh. How do you like my real hard hits? Man, it feels good to finally let loose. Well, good for you. Pokemon number three defeated. Gudra, Gudra, Gudra. It's a battle of the dragons. Duck into Freya. Yep, that's just gonna keep hitting me, isn't it? Gudra fainted. 
The Dunsparce. Yeah, let's get right down back out. The Dunsparce. Is that the rare form? Three segments? It might be. A critical hit at a critical moment. That goes beyond luck. You've got some kind of gift. Used coil. And the Dunsparce fainted. Meowscarada. Yeah. It's all down to this, my last Pokemon. We're gonna fight with everything we've got. Have I been getting experience this fight? I don't think I have. Yeah, I haven't. Level 66, eh? No, this is a bad matchup. She's gonna tear her into grass type. So, body press isn't gonna do that much against... Welp. Shine blazingly bright, my greatest treasure. Get ready to see how strong Miascarada has grown since the day we all met. That's gonna hit you. Sorry, buddy. Yep, not much I can do about that. Oh, and a crit on her, really? See that crit? I clenched that through sheer determination to win. Well, I... Alright, alright. Hmm. Might as well try. And that depends on if I can actually go first. Also, she has dark moves, which is going to be super effective. Shit. Yep, Shadow Claw. I wish I could terrestrialize and then... And then heal up. That would be nice. My Shadow Claw again. Bitter Blade! Baboom. Ooh. You did it! This is legit incredible. You're the strongest out there, Mario Ashley. I mean, you knocked me flat and I was giving you absolutely everything I had. Everything I... I... <laughs> oh man, Pokemon battling, am I right? It's so much better, so much more fun than I ever even knew. Thanks for that incredible match. You beat me for real this time. Aww.
Now let's give ourselves a minute and have a quick break, Mammy Ashley. Before round two! Excuse me? Which Pokemon should I bring out this time? Decisions, decisions! Really? Really? <laughs> Victory Road. Complete. And nothing gets changed in here. No champion trophy, nothing. That is disappointing. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. So that is... Yeah, that is... The Victory Road story complete. Lovely. So, two objectives left then. I have to talk to Cassiopeia. And then... So that the Path of Legends. Oh boy. Oh boy. I was gonna say, why am I... I'll lie down for a rest, sure. Does that change time of day? No. That would have been great. Really? Nothing gets changed around here? I can't, like, make my own sandwiches here? Nothing. That really sucks. <laughs> oh, wait, there's a... There's a new event with you? I had to beat the Elite Four to get your event? Okay. Sure, sure. All right, I guess there's a little more to check out before I end the video. Hello. The, nurse the students called this Miriam Mimi. I tried using that nickname with her once, but she just glared at me. Yeah, I think that's a younger generation thing. Hello. Hey there, coming in. Everyone's welcome in the nurse's office. Oh, Marish, and I'm glad to hear. I have some good news, you're not going to believe this, but I passed the health teacher certification certifi certification exam. Congratulations! Thank you so much. I see you pushing yourself real hard with your treasure hunt, and that really inspired me. Of course, most of the credit for my success goes to my own hard work, though. <laughs> Thanks for giving me the push I needed to try again. Max revives. Nice. But they tell me there's no room to add new classes this year. So I guess I'll keep being Nurse Miriam for a bit. Just you wait, though. I'll be standing in front of a class at this academy before you know it. It'll be in the DLC. Then I'll teach you all you need to know about health. I bet I'll make a great teacher. I can't wait to see you in class. You formed a close bond with Nurse Miriam. Aww. That was super cute. Yeah, that's really all I can go to, isn't it? Yeah, Schoolyard will trigger the Cassiopeia event. I don't want to do that this video. Do you have anything new? I guess I could always check. No, you still want the Sweet Herb and Mystica, which I can't get till post-game. Uh, Jack probably still wants me to fill in the Pokedex, doesn't he? Which I can't really do until I get some version exclusives. Uh-huh.
174 battled, 167 caught. 33 to go. And finally, Ryfort probably wants me to go after the four legendaries. Right? Yes. Okay, so there's not really much else I can do then. Uh huh. Uh huh. So I think with that, I'm gonna end this video here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So. No, I didn't want to trigger this! You know what? I've got Nanus here. <laughs> So, this has been Dragon of Eternity going through more Pokemon Violet. In this video, I took on the top champion, Gita. I got my title as a champion in Paldia. And then I fought my rival, Nimona, once again. She came at me with a level 65 team. And I was able... To defeat her. And that is the Victory Road storyline complete. Next time, I am going to finish, hopefully, the Starfall Street storyline by talking to Clive. Uh huh. Uh huh. So, with that planned out, viewers, my rambling, hopefully now finally done. Until next time.